Next tonight, the murder of Rob Knox and the effect it had on his family is the subject of a new documentary on ITVX. The aspiring actor was stabbed to death in Sidcup just days after filming his breakthrough role as Marcus Belby in Harry Potter. Today, his father told ITV News he hopes sharing their story will get people talking about knife crime. He's been speaking to Carolyn Sim. I think in my heart, I knew that he was probably dead then. It's a story of grief. He just went to me, Mum, quick, leave the car, get down there, Rob's on the pavement. Of a young actor from Bexley who'd landed a part in a Harry Potter movie. So shocking, so he was a very easy and naturally talented guy to work with. And it's a story about knife crime, of an 18-year-old stabbed to death and the rising numbers of young victims just like him. Rob's dad told me he hopes the documentary will get people talking. Most people are saying, well, oh, it's just another death. It's, they've become immune to it. It's, it's, it's another one, it's another one. It's... But when you say another one, that means a person's been killed. That means there's a family that is wrecked for the rest of their lives. So Rob is the vehicle, the medium, for us to speak to her as listening. Rob had been trying to protect his brother when he was stabbed outside a bar in Sidcup in May 2008. In the days after his death, his family spoke to reporters. It's my best friend. He never got to see his performance as student Marcus Belby in Harry Potter and the Half-Blood Prince. The film was released six weeks after his death. Fellow actors recall their shock. He was definitely not the sort of character, in my mind, that would have got involved in something like that at all. So to hear that his life had come to the end in that manner was, was distressing, I think, for all of us. We thought it was very important to include as many of the cast of Harry Potter in there as possible because we knew that going forward the strength would be we would have to play to those tabloids back in 2008, the Harry Potter actor. I'm of the murder of Rob. As the film points out, there have been nearly 3,000 victims of fatal knife crime since Rob's death, and his dad wants people to know the pain it causes. People say that time's a healer. I tend to say that you adopt a, a new way of life um, to deal with the loss, the fact that I won't be going to his wedding, his, his, the, the birth of any children that I may have had. I've been robbed of that. It's and it's actor Ray Winston who enforces the simple message. Never. I wish it all stopped tomorrow, but I'm afraid that's not going to happen. It's just getting worse. When's it all going to end? Carolyn Sim, ITV News.